Cloud NC presents the Minecraft Chicken Machining Challenge. What's faster, factory-proven cutting data or AI-powered physics-based machining? Let's find out. The rules are simple. We're machining two identical Minecraft-style chickens. Both will be programmed using Cam Assist. The first, using our trusted, factory-proven cutting data. The second, powered by AI, also using Cam Assist, but this time using physics-based parameters from our Cutting Parameters module. Shortest cycle time wins. Now here's the thing, building a tool database with proven cutting data, that takes years. You start with the manufacturer's catalog, extract the recommended data, then test, optimize, and validate. Only then can you save it as a proven preset. It's slow, it's manual, and it's essential. Until now. Today we're using our trusty three-axis Haas VF2. Simple setup, limited axes. So for this challenge, we're keeping it fun. A classic, blocky, Minecraft-style chicken, just like in the game. Iconic, clucky, perfect. Jay's job is to program the first chicken using Fusion 360 and cam assist with cutting parameters all pulled from our factory presets. Then we duplicate the entire process. Same part, same machine, same tools, same setups. But this time, cam assist is using only physics-based parameters from the cutting parameters module. Now we run cam assist. Cam Assist generated a full five operation program in no time. Which one gets machined faster? Let's run it and see. This little experiment shows the power of AI in manufacturing. Automating toolpath and cutting parameter generation doesn't just save time. It frees engineers to focus on creativity and strategy. Of course, AI is not a replacement for human expertise, but it's a powerful tool to have in the workshop. With factory presets, the chicken took 42 minutes and 20 seconds to machine. With AI-powered cutting data, the cycle time dropped to 35 minutes and 12 seconds. That's a 17% reduction, thanks to our AI. Two chickens, one winner, but both proving just how far we've come.